Hey, Tim and Joel. Now, we spun up the age game. And we did, I love the age. Do you have any idea what today's age game is going to be all about? Tim says a name, you say their age. For example, Sean Mendes is 23. It's called the age game. Hang on, is Mendes 23? It's only 23. Is that can't be right. He's done a lot, hasn't oh, he's he? He's lived a life. Oh. <laughs> um, I have a I have a guess. <laughs> Speaking of vents and holes. <laughs> oh my goodness! Woofed. Sean Mendy. Woofed. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Oh my God. 23, that really grinds my gears. <laughs> oh, does it, does it oh, steam get, your greens? Does it get oh, your ghoulies? Uh, <laughs> hey, come on, that's Jonesy oh, stuff. Oh, I know, I was listening. Oh, no, don't worry. <laughs> oh, no, you weren't. I was. No, I wasn't. Never. Yeah. Um, I've got a guess. Is it an Oscars edition? Yep. Oh, is it? Is really? It? Yeah. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> um, I'll tell you what it is, though, in a second. Loz, Kate's playing for you today. Hello, Loz. Hello, guys. How are you? We're great, Loz. Have you seen any any of the Oscar movies that's been nominated today, Loz? Uh, No, I haven't seen them and I haven't seen House of Gucci. Oh, Loz, you're missing out. Lady Gaga is sensational in it. I'll take your word for it. Yeah, I've actually got a little bit of uh, the House of Gucci for you if you'd like to. uh, to, Let me see if I can find it. Yeah, this is for you, Loz, if you haven't seen it. Uh, you will never get this. You will never get this. La, 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 la. That's Lady Gaga. Ah, yeah, everybody. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's never going to get oh, off. Oh, Oh, Loz. <laughs> you don't have to see it. It's rubbish. Um, I am. Cal, oh, we all know you like Gucci. You can play real or fake after seven. <laughs> Cal. Hello, how are you doing? Oh, hi, G'day, Cal. Cal. Have you seen House of Gucci? No, I have not, but I think you'll do well for me, Joel. You're in good hands. Oh. You're in good hands. <laughs> no, so don't, don't, don't unpack it. Who's in whose hands? Please, Cal's no. trying. Now, um, <laughs> we'd like you guys to flip a coin to, to work it out because um, oh. we're doing. We're going to do the ages of either the best actor in a leading role categories or best actresses in oh, the leading role be categories. So we're going to give actresses to you, Kate, because we're stereotypical. Bloody and I'm a lady. We're also the mainstream <laughs> media, you know. Bloody <laughs> the lame stream media, am I oh, right? You got me. <laughs> Joel will give you the actors in a leading role. Oh, I didn't want them. Um, who would like to flip? Who would like to say the, you know. Well, let, let Joel do it. Tails. Hey, Gucci. Hey, Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> Hey Gucci, flip mm. a coin. I was going to say, mm. Jesus, that's funny, isn't it? That stuff just creeps Hilarious. in. Hilarious. Oh, on the brain, Billy. Gucci on the brain. Hey Gucci. Hi everybody. <laughs> hey Google. Hey Google. Flip a coin. Oh, no, it's not plugged in. You got heads. <laughs> Who was what that? Does that <laughs> Gates heads. What does okay, that mean? Good. I got heads. So, we got, so we're, we're doing actresses. actress in a leading role. Oh yes, great. It's best of three closest oh, without Joel. going over for a five hundred dollar OPSM voucher. Keep in mind, That's this an is for Laws price. or Cal, by the way, not for us. Gosh, can't give Kate any more free stuff. <laughs> um, all right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get free stuff. You can't get free stuff. No, I don't, mate. Don't tell me you paid for that. This outfit. <laughs> It's an old one. I've had it for ages. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> when oh. denim jumpsuits are in. It's not a jumpsuit. It's a dress. Oh, is that? That's cute. Yeah, dress. <laughs> oh, my God. Being no, the, the Ricardos. Let's do Nicole Kidman. Our Nicole. Oh. Are you texting me, Joe? Uh, about the age game or other stuff? <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, I'll text you my answer. Yeah, good one, John. Thanks, Kate. Um, <laughs> you know why he's on stage? That, that stuff, oh, no. stuff like that. Isn't it? I'm so sharp. <laughs> I thought, actually, I texted Kate the other day and because I, I assumed oh, I was Kate flattered. and Nicole were like really tight friends. <laughs> I assume everyone fabulous is friends with Kate. What? so funny about that? That's funny, Joel. I mean, you've said some funny things. Well, I was watching Being the Ricardos and I thought, oh, Kate would be, like, really close with Nicole Kidman. So I text Kate because I wanted to her to pass on a compliment to Nicole for <laughs> But Nicole's never been to the X Games. Bam, bam, X Bandits was only a movie. <laughs> <laughs> and Nicole gets around in her vans and her globes. I've never been to the X Games, by the way. Well, how do you know so many people from it? I don't. <laughs> oh, you 
You are so many photos at it, but you've not been there. I've never been there. Okay, you're both Joe, don't you jump on board? <laughs> I don't you're even know what here. they are. <laughs> well, they're not something the cold go to. That's all you need to know. <laughs> or me. <laughs> Anymore. Okay, you're both in. Uh, Nicole. Kate, Nicole's BFF, said 53. And, oh, Joel, you said 59. <gasps> She's oh, not. No. She is 54. Kate oh. Ritchie. Yay, Kate. Oh, cool, Laws, was. we're doing it. <laughs> Are you they're still there? That's cool. It's <laughs> cool. It's cool, isn't it? Do you think Loz, do you think Kate and Nicole Kidman would make good friends? Absolutely. BFX. Yeah. Thank you, Loz. Um, you know, OPSM has uh, your eyewear needs sorted with the latest styles and brands to suit you and your lifestyle. Head to OPSM in store or online today. Uh, okay, this is for the win, Kate, to stay in the oh game, Joel. God. We're doing actress in a leading role. Let's do Kristen Stewart for Spencer. <laughs> Which I believe is very good. She's very good. Very good. She's a front runner to win. Now she's Gaga's unreal. not in the, in the running. Um, she's my favourite in that I know category. She is. Well, you know what? It's very, Penelope Cruz as well, right up there for me. What did you write, Kate? Oh, she's got you again. I got you. Oh, there you go. Watch out. All right, well, you're both in. Kate, you said 32 and changed it to three. And Joel, you said 27. She's 27. Kristen oh. Stewart is 31. Oh, no! So, Joel, you're in. Mm. Mm, interesting how She's things play out. She's not 27, you idiot. Tiebreaker! All right, for the win, for the 500 bucks to spend at OPSM, here we go. Let's do it. Let's actually do Penelope Cruz. She's okay. in Parallel oh. Mothers. She's nominated with her husband, Javier Bardem, in the actor in a leading role category. The sixth husband and wife team to be married and nominated for the actor and actress roles in the same year. Great trivia, Blackers. I just don't know much about Penelope. Neither do I, really. But you know what she looks like. No, well, judging from your answer, you really don't. <laughs> Me? Yep, yeah, you. Really? Oh, no. Did you get mine? Yep, yeah, you've said 51, Joel. You've said 54, Kate. She is 47, which means we have to go uh, again. Oh. Is she 47? Mm. Yeah. She looks brilliant, doesn't she? I accidentally text that my first answer for Penelope to my accountant. Just said 51. <laughs> sell. No, what does that sell, mean? Ah, <laughs> oh, finance. If only I understood you. Oh, I know. Crypto. I know. Oh, oh, so fun, isn't it? Let's go to the pub with our polo shirts on and talk crypto. Have you seen the ad on TV? Oh, don't worry. <laughs> Have you done that? Uh, okay, let's do Olivia Coleman here for the tiebreaker. Oh, she's Olivia amazing, Coleman. isn't she's she? Won, was she the last winner of the Best Actress Oscar? No, Who was Francis that? won last year. Oh, that's Obama. right. Mm. Um, Olivia Coleman. You might know her from The Night Manager, a great series with Hugh Laurie. Not all the people in the team think it's great, but <laughs> no. it's really in Broad great. Church, she was really good in that. Was she and Are You Being Served, or was that just... <laughs> was that just... <laughs> Shane Bourne. I loved her as the vicar of Dibley. <laughs> that was very good. Um, oh, man. Oh, you're in again. Okay, good stuff. I'm in. Joel, I'm in. Please, let's let this be over oh, after this one. I love the age game. It's why I joined this show, Joel. Olivia you know that? <laughs> really? I used to listen to it in the car. Oh, oh. yeah, we've all heard that story. <gasps> um, <laughs> okay, you're both in. Kate Ritchie said 48. Joel yeah. Creasy said 51. Oh, she, on, probably on, is, on, she probably is early 50. She's 48, Kate Ritchie. <laughs> oh, no! Knocker! Loz, we did it! Congratulations, Loz! Well done. You got the OPSM voucher worth 500 bucks. Congratulations. Thank you. Kate, Tim and Joel on Nova. Weirdest thing you were convinced to eat, 13, 24, 10. Let's open up the phones, guys. 13, 24, 10. <laughs> Is he trying to organise? You're a bit late. You're a bit. You're a bit late to have your brekkie, Jess. <laughs> Jess has got a little brekkie bowl of birch and muesli in there. Oh, that's nice. It's cute. We've got KFC Come and Chill. Very healthy, Jess. <laughs> yeah, don't scoff your birch just so you can have popcorn chicken. No, it's very homophobic to have birch and muesli the Monday after Mardi Gras, <laughs> Jess. <laughs> Did you vote no? <gasps> Jess, we've oh, spoken about this. She would have. Come on, Jess. She would have. <laughs> um, third and twenty fourteen. The weirdest thing you're convinced to eat. Can we open the phones? <laughs> 13, 24, 10, the weirdest thing you're convinced to wait. Don't forget, just by jumping on air, mm. you are in the running for First Class and Fiddy K. Thanks to our good friends at Etihad Airways as well. You'll be flying First Class with Etihad. Oh, 
Oh my How God, good is that? Amazing. You wouldn't be eating anything weird on board there. Just delicious. Can you convince me to do anything in first class? I'll eat it all. I'll drink it all. Absolutely. Got to stay up the whole flight. You know. Oh, take... no sleeping. Uh, under no circumstance. I even think maybe watching a movie is almost a bit too, like giving some of it away, oh, depending yes. on how long the flight is. No, you want to hobnob around the cabin, get I to know, know the get to know the crew, swarm back to economy, let everyone know that you're flying first class. Didn't you have a little uh, couch in one of your areas once? I did, yes. I had a little... A and little what did set. you got... do on that couch? Like, did you just go and sit on it just because you could? I was flying on my own and I, I was very kindly given an upgrade um, and I was I was coming back from Amsterdam. <laughs> so <laughs> I was feeling a bit rough. Yeah, right. You'll be shocked to hear. You know, like, did you get on first class and like, do you have any Doritos? <laughs> I was like, I'm really emotional. <laughs> got all, all this emotion flooding out of me. And who's that um, sitting in 22F? Is that Lynn McGranger? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine Lynn in Amsterdam. Who? Uh, Lynn McGranger. Oh, yeah. No, oh, my God. You should get her out of a cafe. <laughs> no, no, under no circumstance. Not Lynn McGranger. <laughs> She'd probably eat this thing, actually, we're about mm. to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever been so hungry you would eat this? Yeah. Now, science scientists mm. have announced plans to examine a mummified mermaid. A mummified <laughs> mermaid that is rumoured to grant immortality to anyone who tastes its flesh. Oh, my God. We've got the photo now, here. How rank is that, first of all? And also, who wants immortality? Like, I'm exhausted. I don't want to be... If I could still be... If I could be immortal now at this age, I'll do it. Yeah. But I don't want to keep getting older. Well, then you need to eat the eat some of the mermaid now. Look at the fingernails and the That's, hair and stuff. It's really wrong looking. Um, researchers <laughs> from the... Kurshiki University oh, yeah. of Science and the Arts, one of my favourites. I tried to. Get I didn't him there. get in there. I oh, didn't. I didn't. Oh, no. didn't you? <laughs> I didn't lose out. I sent my um, thesis and everything. <laughs> and, my, and my lookbook. <laughs> your look. I sent me a lookbook and didn't get in. Your, your lookbook. I remember that was a thing on um, what was the, Project, the, Runway. Project Runway. We were talking about that to Kate the other day. And yes. She's like, you, I can't believe you watched that. And I'm like, I loved Project Runway. It was so good. They'd go out and go sees with their lookbook. <laughs> go sees. Um, anyway, which is not a thing. I've asked actual models. Um, now, research. Researchers have revealed they'll be taking the mummified mermaid for CT scans in order to get to the bottom of its mysterious form and legend. Mm. Um, there is a legend in many parts of Japan that a woman once accidentally ate the flesh of a mermaid and lived for 800 years. <laughs> <laughs> what? Is there proof of this lady? Oh, get a grip. Get a grip. Although Japan, Japanese people live very long lives. And they, they eat I mean, well. They, yeah, you they know, are amazing. They, but yeah, 800 years. Who wants to live for 800 years? I know. What's there to say? Got 800 seasons of maths. Oh, boring. <laughs> Seen it all. Yeah. Oh, you should have been around for the first two when it was good. <laughs> when Innes was on it or whatever her name was. Um, it's said that people believed this myth and used to eat the scales of the mermaid mummy. Oh, the oh, scales. scales. Mm, people also worshipped it. Mm-hmm. Um, and the findings from the scientific examination of the mummy will be published later this year. I'll no doubt not follow that up. So, And neither will anyone in the team? No. Um, 13, 24, 10, the weirdest thing you're convinced to eat. We're talking mummified mummies. That's what we do when the boys are just hanging out and chatting. I know. Mummified. We love it. All things Egypt. We're reg- regular Molly Meldrums. <laughs> oh, we oh. really are. And mermaid enthusiasts. Down where it's wet and take it from me. Thank you, Sebastian and the Crab. Yeah. Um, yeah, this is about researchers from Kurashiki University of Science and the Arts where you didn't get in, Blackers. No, my lookbook um, was sent back. <laughs> if not, you are out, in the words of <laughs> Paddy Plum. <laughs> we should play like bits of Project Runway from early days. Oh, that was so good. Did we hello, Mo. hello, Mo. <laughs> Tim Gunn. What was the other thing he said? Oh, hello, designers. Hey, hello, designers. <laughs> hello, designers. He's like, are you okay? Yeah. Because <laughs> you don't sound it. Tim Gunn is almost 800, I think. Tim Gunn would be the closest thing in age to this mermaid, um, which is 800 years old, and people in Japan believe that if you eat the scales of this mummified mermaid, mm. it, you will grant, it'll grant grant you immortality, which I honestly couldn't think of anything worse. I could, actually. A lot of things. So I'm looking up, for, I'm, looking up I'm just seeing an interview with Tim oh. Gunn and Anderson Cooper. I mean, imagine oh. that chat. Jess is suggesting, make it work. He used to always say that. Oh. Good one, Jess. Yeah, make that's it work. good. Make it work. When he'd go to, over to your desk and you'd have absolutely no idea what you're doing, there's fabric everywhere, and he didn't know what to say to you either, so he'd just go, make it work, <laughs> goodbye designers, and then you'd be eliminated in the, in the uh, runway. Of course. 
What a great show. Oh, here we show. go. Here's some, here's, here's some greatest moments of Tim Gunn. This is just YouTube. I'm live YouTubing here, so let's see. Hopefully this is okay. Oh, that's, the, that's the song. Roger Runway, yes. The boys now, do. you may recognize this distinguished and very handsome man right next to me. This is Tim Gunn. Welcome, designers. Yay! <laughs> there he is. Sleep tonight. <laughs> yeah. Shop, shop, shop. Like a halter diaper. Go, go, go. It is kind of an uh oh. Coo coo. 30 minutes to caucus. <laughs> it's John Pump. What? Yeah. Go, go, go. Exuberant. Sophisticated. 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 What is that? You have a conundrum. <laughs> I am not bored. Go, go, go. Pops out. I love you. I'm woeful. <laughs> Annie, get your gun. <laughs> hey, this has a definitely a wow factor potential. Designers, designers, okay. designers, 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 designers. And he always walks in with the holding his watch. <laughs> designers, go go go. Designers, <laughs> <laughs> gotta be good doing that job hungover. You walk in, and go, oh, what am I doing today? They go, just say designers, hold yeah. your watch, and just say make it work, and then we'll wrap. <laughs> Tim Gunn. Um, what were you first to eat? Forced to eat? I was mm. forced to eat um, scorpion on a stick in China. Oh, uh, was that for getaway? Uh, yes, it was. Yeah. Oh. It was. <laughs> right, so you're getting paid. <laughs> and um, bamboo worms. So the worms inside bamboo, mm. deep fried. Yeah. It was like popcorn. But it's that's one Yum. of those things again. Who thought to eat that first time? Well, a lot of people that you speak to, in, especially even Angelina Jolie, not that I chat to her that often these days. Yeah. Um, but she reckons that that's the most sustainable food. There's so much of it, and you can actually eat it and get nutritional value out of it. And it's, the bugs and stuff everywhere, mate. What bamboo or bugs? Bugs. Okay. Well, yeah, you can eat bamboo. I've now. taken it on board. I'm not going to change the way I live. But yeah. Cool. Don't they always have like that weird little thing in Thai food? Sometimes you go. What's that? And everyone goes, oh, that's bamboo. You forget that sometimes bamboo is in your food. I know, yeah. It's like a fun surprise. <laughs> oh, I'm a panda. <laughs> Obviously, I don't like it because it's bamboo. It's awful. But, but yes, I'm a big panda. I'm a big panda now. Okay, you made the decision for me. <laughs> cool. No, 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 no. <laughs> you can make a fence out of it um, and also put it in your stir fry. <laughs> well, I told you I met Wang Wang, the panda at Adelaide Zoo. Oh, I thought you met, met, met Wang Wang at the day party <laughs> no, last year. On the weekend. Um, Mr. Mr. Mrs. is saying he ate sheep poo. For my brothers, oh, yeah, I've got a sheep. Pretended sheep. to eat it, telling me it was chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> sheep poo. I did that to my little brother once. So it was like this little tiny bit of avocado, and it was wasabi. Oh, oh I love burn. Oh, Jane said my older sister put a bull ant between two Jats biscuits and made me eat it. Oh, oh okay. Right. Mm. Liz. <laughs> Hi there, how you doing? Talking about oh, eating yeah, this mummified, mum, mummified mermaid, mm. and you can live for 800 years, maybe. Um, <laughs> what were you forced to eat, or convinced to eat? Liz? <laughs> oh, hi there. Hi, um, Liz. I was convinced to eat, eat raw chicken in Japan. Oh, Liz, oh, how did you fall no. for that? Well, I was on my first ever business trip and I was young and I got taken out and went to this amazing chicken restaurant where the, all they served was chicken. There were like 12 different dishes. Chicken restaurant. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yum. And you had you had raw chicken there. Raw chicken and you had to dip it in raw egg. It was delicious. I was worried all night oh. I was going to... Yeah, I know. I'm so- out of both ends. Yeah, all right. It's no, no, you didn't. You're still here today, Liz. Thank you very no, much. Maybe she's 800. I know. Liz. Liz doesn't really know what's going on, does she? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> really had to be prompted there. <laughs> you know, when I played the, this bit, when oh, I played the right. I don't care, she went, what? It was <laughs> just business. She, just, she, she was just here for business. <laughs> Maybe she was just wanting more Tim Gunn. <laughs> I know. I remember go, when we go, played go. a minute of Pops Tim Gunn. Out. I love you. I'm woeful. Annie, get your gun. <laughs> Belinda, what about you? What were you convinced to eat? I was convinced to eat snail. Oh, yum. Oh, in France or like a raw snail? No, they were, they were in a like, garlic sauce, but it was on a cruise ship. My brother forced me to eat them. Oh, oh on a cruise like, ship. Oh, okay. How's the gastro after that? You know, a lot of people find these a delicacy, so... The escar goes delicious, enough garlic and... Olive oil and stuff. It's just garlic and butter. Yeah, it's just yeah, it's a vessel for garlic and butter. Yeah, let's talk about the cruise ship, Belinda. This is Woo! Kate, Tim and Joel. No. Tim says a name, you say their age. For example, Tom Cruise is sixty. It's called the age game. Sixty. Tom Cruise, you see, I listened to an interview with that Ryan Tedder from One Republic about writing the song for the Top Gun movie. Mm. You know, the beach scene. Mm. He actually edited that scene as well to his own song. 
What? Ryan did. Yeah, him and his crew. So it was wow. set to the music rather yeah, than like the he, music being set to it. He said it was like made, yeah, because it was an original song, and he was like, he made it for the film. It was like making a film clip. Oh, rock and roll. Isn't that cool. Oh, God, that's Isn't so that cool. cool. So cool. Oh. Right. Now, Joe, hello. Kate is playing hello. for you today. Hello. Hey, Kate. Good luck. Uh, it's been all those positive vibes for me today. Yeah, I'm so positive. You know me. Yep, she's Little up and Miss about. Positive. Mm. Um, and uh, Sharon, Joel's got you today. G'day. Oh, hi, Sharon. Hey, Joel, you got this, buddy. Thanks, girlfriend. Yes, I do. Yeah, you got it. You got what it. are we playing for? Oh, the headphones. The Bose headphones, guys. Yes, now, Sharon, I'm going to get the them for you. You did guess it, Kate Ritchie, because it's a live age game. I'll explain oh, what God. that means in a second. Hi, my name is... I'm Gemma from Digital. I'm Leno from Programming. I'm Jody from Music. I'm Jess from Integration. I'm Ron Wilson from the News Department. <laughs> and this is the live edition. The live edition. Good life! Uh, funny, none of those people are doing it today, oh. but we, oh, have, okay. we have five new people if we need it. Five people who work, live and breathe in this building. Actually, the only five people left who aren't working from home I was going to say, I'm impressed that you found five people I know. in the building. And that's really sad if we've got five people and we're not going to need five people because two of them have probably waited back for the game stuff, and then they they're, they're not ever going to be on the air. Well, they want to meet you they've for met, the first I've time. I've met all of these people and out no, there. Um, you've not met most of them, they're actually. Probably well, having... I haven't seen this guy for ages, though, the first one oh, in well, the line. You've got an unfair advantage. Well, let's bring Luke Minto in, our first contestant today. You tell me it's closest without going over. Good day, Luke. Luke. Good, good. Yeah, this is Luke Minto, our group commercial director from Agency Sales. <laughs> He's holding uh, um, that up, which is great. Your age is on the other side, so be yes. careful. Maybe I'm cover, your, cover so, it up. Someone's gone to the effort of laminating yeah, this. Laminating. Laminated? Yeah, it's a bit excessive. I know. Um, but I like it. Land oh, the girls love a laminate. Oh, oh, I know. Okay, okay. so Luke. doing stuff that makes them feel important. Luke, now, how long have you been with the company? 18 years. 18 years. Yeah. Oh, you were at that fancy lunch the other day. Oh, no, you weren't, apparently. Thanks for the invite. (laughs) I'll cover that up. I can see your age. I can't. I can't see it. Now, I always try and work out what everyone else's age is. Based on yours? By my age. So if I'm 43... 43 And and the rest? Hmm, I think you're a bit older than me, Luke. Stay out of it. Wait, wait, let's see if Luke (laughs) recognises this song, because this is Kate's favourite song. So if he he (laughs) recognises it, it might mean that you're older than Kate. It's not even funny. Don't even That's fun the oldest, that. the oldest known recording of a track. <laughs> <laughs> Never gets old. See? Okay, I'm lodging my answer. Okay, can I have it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you can have it. It's nice to be able to hand it over in person. No, isn't this great? Live age game. Kate to be Richie, a group up. commercial director. I know. Got to be right? pretty important, pretty senior. He's been around as long as I have. I've, mm. I've known Luke in this company for as ages, ages, yeah. and ages. Because he's a good you. worker and a great guy. Yeah, you're a big deal. Yeah, so, yeah exactly right. Good workers mm. and great guys. Yeah. Mm. Here we are. Well, you keep always very nicely about slipping it. through the cracks. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, you're both in. Now, Joel Creasy, you've said 44 for Luke Minto. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kate Ritchie, you've said 45 with a love heart over the eyes. Oh, he's a married man. Kate. Luke Minto is... How old, Luke Minto? 46. Yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> Kate Ritchie. back of your laminated sheet. Knew shape. it. Mm. Thank you, Luke. Well, you didn't. <laughs> what? You didn't. Yeah, you were off by a year. <laughs> you were just closest. What did I say? 45. Yeah, I got it, though. Yeah, but you didn't He's know He's 46. It. I knew how I knew he was I old. knew it, but you didn't. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> oh, hi. hi. Cass is here next. Hello, Cass. Would you oh, like to introduce Cass. yourself with your uh, occupation, sure. please? So, um, my name's Cass mm. Wood. I'm a <laughs> <laughs> digital audio and client implementation executive. Do you yes. know what that is? Oh, wow. Yes, I do. It's what very she, important. What, what we need it. Every what does she do? She does the implementing of things. There's no of idea. what, though? <laughs> of um, executives on exe- the title. Of so. the executives. In sales. Oh, yes. you're so gorgeous. I know, I don't, don't it's throwing me. Quiz me. <laughs> you look fabulous, Pass. by the way. Do you, Thank is you. this is this how you do you dress like this every day? Um, I try to. Oh yeah. my god. Would you normally be here at five thirty seven? Um, <laughs> no. And can Would you not so come in here dressed like that? Yeah, you look because incredible. Because Blackers is always like, oh, you girls around here need to lift your game. And Why are you me in wearing that? another hoodie, Kate? Well, you're wearing some kind of woolen, woolen thing. <laughs> Like you're on a Sunday brunch like, run. Cass, you don't need to say <laughs> that. I have a note flat white, please. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't want to... Oh, guess what, mate? Oh, you're not allowed Kasha. to comment on what I look like at work. It's illegal. Is it? Why? Yes. Even though you dress for me. <laughs> Cass, how long have you been with the company? Um, Since last May. <laughs> oh, okay. I know. You're freshy. That doesn't yeah. change anything. I don't know why well, I keep asking that. 2021. 
Nice. Okay. Oh, like okay. the same as still me. Freshy, okay. But, yeah. Yeah. You know, you're still fresh. A year and a half. Yeah. Freshman year. Okay. Can we yeah. have ages, please? Sorry, I'm lodging my answer. Because uh, Kate, if you get this, you won. Well, don't get it. Yeah. Because there's on. other people that want to come yeah, into the Yeah. Studio. Don't make them feel bad. Mm. All right. You're in. I don't. I don't want to be offensive. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. Joel's in. <laughs> don't I mean. worry. Come on, mate. We did oh a lot last minute change. Okay. What is Because I wanted to play hard. Okay. All right. Well, you're both in. And I've won it, haven't I? Joel, you said 25 for Cass. Oh, no. Oh, that's what I went originally. And Kate, you said 26 for Cass. Oh, no. Cass, how old are you? 27. Yeah, no! I knew it! Oh, can we get one more in? Just... Yes, oh, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we double or nothing? Yeah, yes, double or nothing. Double or nothing. Yeah. Hey, you know what? Thanks, we'll, give, we'll give two. Thank thanks, you. Cass. Thanks, we'll give, Cass. We'll give two sets of headphones away. Yes. Um, and I'm just making that up. We can't keep all these people that? waiting and then not yeah, use them. Let's we do, do them all. Let's get them in. Hard Come on, and Mitch. Let's yeah. go, Mitch. Oh, hey, Mitch. Hi, Mitch. Hey, guys, senior. What's going on? Now, senior is your last name, not your description of oh. your job. Is that right? Correct. I'm mean, sure people use that all the time. What do you do here, mate? I'm the learning and development business partner. What does that mean? Mean you're still learning? It does. But you know all those like WHS modules you guys should have been doing? No. They all came from me. I love doing. Oh, what's a WHS? I do one away. Workplace health and safety. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we did one this week. Yeah. yeah. Joel always vapes outside. Yeah, I do one. <laughs> <laughs> I do one every week because I like to keep fresh. You know, do all the app it. stuff, all yeah. the things on yeah, the app. Right. Well, I don't, yeah, go to the Nova Player, win the yeah. Neighbours competition. <laughs> yeah. Kate grand. needs to unlock her phone if you can teach her how to do that. <laughs> oh, no, she knows how to do that. I Believe think me. the way they speak to me every day is against all the rules. He's not HR. Saying? This is double Ooh, Learning and development. <gasps> oh, he's HR. Yes. You beautiful thing. <laughs> I thought Thank that was you. PX. Yeah. PX slash HR. Oh, I can't oh that makes it easy to remember. All right. All right, let's do this. Come on, Kate. You're very young and Joe and Sharon, you're both going to win headphones. So don't worry about it. Yay! You put down. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, I'm watching my answer. This is good. Okay, oh, I nearly good. went a bit older, All but right. I think... Kate Ritchie, you said 28 for Mitch. Oh, and uh, Joel, you said 26. You're not 26. Mitch, how old are you, buddy? Actually 32. Yeah. Oh, my God! Oh, Kate Ritchie. I nearly went 31. Wow, we're the same age. Thanks, I'm in good snap. <laughs> wow. uh, thanks for coming in. Good luck Thank with all the other PXHR yeah. stuff. I'll, I'll find you soon. You. Yeah. See you next week. That's right. <laughs> yeah, um, that, was meeting. that was nice. Yeah, that was good. fun. What about the other two out there? Are you serious? I don't know. We can't keep people. Well, can we just point through the window at them and guess ages? That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> you bring them in and you just say, I'm okay, go. old. Okay, go. All right, come on. Quick. Go quick. Quick, quick, quick. Go, go. Let's get the other come two. On, Gemma. Oh, that's Gemma. I know how old Gemma, she is. Gemma, come on. Bring them in, Gem. Yeah. Hopefully. Don't worry about all that Who's stuff. That? Don't worry about Who's all that, that stuff. Yeah, we've got Georgie and Georgie. we've got Dave. Georgie oh. and Dave. Georgie and Dave. Georgie's oh, hi, Georgie. 24. You're a, oh, you're a uh, campaign specialist. Yes, 25. Right. How, old are you? How old are you? Go. Me, right yeah. now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 24. Yeah! Oh, you're so good at this game. Okay, come okay, on. Okay, next, Dave, next, Dave, next. Dave, Dave. Let's go. Next. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, my God. You're lovely. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is Dave McHugh. He's oh graphic God. designer. We marketing. know Dave. Yes. I love a graphic designer. Oh, yeah. 32. 29. Uh, oh. Yeah! Oh, no. <laughs> no, I'm closer. Hey, Richie. 30. Are you okay? Thanks, I'm guys. just so used to winning. <laughs> and you also want your hitting on everyone that's come in. You hit on everyone I have not hit on Dave. I, I, have a, I have a feeling I'm not up Dave's alley. Thanks, guys. Oh, we should do Gator, not Gator. Oh, oh my God. Oh. Okay, next next week we'll bring in everyone from the office. Oh, my God. Say, are you gay or not? I'm sure that'll go down well. Yeah, I'll see who follows me on Instagram. Kate, Tim and Joel is a Nova podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcast.com.au.